MGF modular bracing strut systems are designed primarily to be used as struts with hydraulic bracing systems. Each strut comprises either hydraulic ram or mechanical jack assemblies together with various lengths of strut extension bars. Assemble the knee brace by lowering the components onto timber skids. Ensure that the joints are properly bolted together with the recommended minimum torque. End fixing details should be bolted to the strut prior to installation. When using swivels, the complete pin swivel should be bolted to the ends that require them in the correct orientation. If brace clamps are required, then the top clamp should be loosely bolted to the upper side of the swivel, ready for landing on top of the brace. Double acting ram assemblies should be pumped out sufficiently to allow for ease of installation. Prior to installation, ensure that the brace has sufficient hanging chains or brackets to take the weight of the strut and any shear stops required by the design are present. Make sure the strut locations are clearly marked and are free from obstruction. Attach the lifting chains to the assembled strut, adjusting the chains to take account of the heavier end. Installation is normally carried out with formation level just below bracing strut level. The assembled knee brace should be carefully lowered into position using a two leg chain, making sure the top swivel clamp hooks over the flange of the brace and the lugs are correctly orientated. The knee brace is now ready to be pumped out so it transfers load into the shear stop detail. Ensure the vertical faces of the fixing plates are bearing directly onto the shear stops and are preloaded to take out any slack. Tighten the bolts on the top clamps after the strut has been fully pressurised. The bottom clamp can now be fitted and both clamps fully tightened. The clamp bolt should be tightened with a recommended minimum torque of 1000 newton meters. Once the strut is pressurized and both swivel clamps secured, the lifting chains can be removed. The process can now be repeated for the remaining knee braces. Excavation can now continue. 